Hey, what's up, my people? How you doing? My name is Dalton, and this is my YouTube channel. That's right. Now, this is going to be about a review of a delivery service that I use and I enjoy. So, and you can use them if you have SNAP and food stamps or just regular credit card. All right. And they're very, very efficient, and they have been around since 1952. That's right. They've been around since 1952, and it's called, I'm going to butcher this, but it's called Sean's uh, Home Delivery Service. That's S-C-H-W-A-N apostrophe S, okay? Sean's Home Delivery Service. Now, I bought $100 worth of food. And I'm going to show you the quality and the amount I got for 100 bucks. Okay, I want you to understand, I'm a single person. I really don't eat that much, especially in spring and summer. I only eat once or twice a day. Okay, now, uh, my car is down. My car is broken. and uh, But a man's got to eat, right? So... I, I remember that uh, I order from them every now and then. And I remember that they take SNAP and food stamps. Some people call it EBT. All right. So let's take a look at this unboxing of what I got here. All right. And also, I got my mic here. Got to adjust real quick. There you go. Hopefully that's a little bit better. Yeah. There we go. All right. It's not my normal mic, but because I'm showing you stuff. All right. Now, I I literally bought about seven items, and it cost a hundred dollars. Okay, and it was and is worth the price, especially if you you can't get to the store. You're not trying to take the bus, whatever. Okay. Here's one thing. I love this. Ancient grain. And look at the quality. You get a lot of this. Okay. Pie. It's already seasoned. Ready to go. Okay. They give you instructions on the back. This is part of their Live Smart. Okay. Line. And they tell you in detail, see, if you see right here, in detail, everything that's in it. So if you're allergic to something, you you see everything that's in it. You don't have to have glasses trying to squeak and stuff like that. They even show you the calories. Okay? That's one. I love broccoli. I love broccoli. So, look at that. Look at the size of that baby. Bought me some broccoli. Even shows you how to cook it. So if you're a bachelor, bachelorette, not really a person that cooks, this gives you the instructions. If you're just now on your out on your own, this gives you instructions. Look at that. Mm. Like that. I love broccoli. Okay. Oh yeah. Prime rib shepherd's pie. Now, I want you to understand. Look at the size of this baby. Prime rib shepherd's pie. Here's the company. Remember that name. Okay. Yeah. Prime rib shepherd's pie. Mm. Good. Got that. What else I got here? Oh, yeah. Hash browns. That's right. Hash browns. Yes, sir. I bumped into the other... The other day, I bumped into this one brother. And we, were, we got talking. And he said, look, brother, I tell you what. You cannot go wrong with 
potatoes and eggs. Okay, when all else fails, potatoes and eggs is what you want to get. You can't go wrong with potatoes and eggs, okay? So, <laughs> hash brown. And, you know, hash brown potatoes, you can, you can use it for a lot of different stuff. Okay. What else did I get? Oh, yeah. Four cheese lasagna. That's right. You know, it's kind of like mama used to make. You know, forget about it. You know it's good. You know it's good. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, man. Meat and four cheese lasagna made with pasta layer between a sweet tomato sauce, savory ground beef, and a blend of mozzarella. All right. Aged Parmesan, Romano cheeses. Mmm. All right, now. This is what I can't wait to try. And I was looking, looking at this. Cheese and broccoli fettuccine Alfredo. Oh, my goodness. I used to work at a real Italian restaurant when I was younger when I was a kid, and uh, they had real Italian food, and I fell in love with the fettuccine alfredo. Oh, my goodness. Ah, Italians know how to do it right. You hear me? <laughs> I, used to, I actually did later on, uh, when I was older, I ended up dating a, a pure Italian woman, okay? And I tell you what, it gave me great respect Great admiration for the strength of Italian man to deal with Italian woman because you need your strength. <laughs> there you go. Let's see. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm going to put this one for last. I'm going to like that. Now, I knew, I often forget about breakfast, but not this time. So, what did I get? Ham and cheese omelets. These are really, really good. I've had these before. And, let me see the size. So, you size it so you want it. So, you know what you're getting here. When you're getting the sizes, they're not bad. You know. I usually eat one or two of these for breakfast. You get uh, six of them in a box. Let's see. Okay. Now, save the best for last. Ladies and gentlemen, they have desserts. They have desserts. They have just about any type of cream pie you can ask for. They Right now, they have uh, pumpkin pies and apple pies. They are established in the United States. So when you're ordering from them, you're keeping American people and employees employed the drivers, the delivery drivers, as well as the manufacturers. And that's a plus in my mind. Okay. Now, here it is, y'all. I'm not going to open it because I, I don't want y'all trying to come over to my house and get none. Okay. But I like to order stuff that I also, when I, sometimes if I have gas, if I have to on the fly, if I have to make, cook something, you know, if they're hungry, you can throw something in the microwave. You know what I'm saying? That's always good. Also, it's great to order from this place around the holidays. Man. Holidays especially. So, remember that. Classic cheesecake. Got that right. <laughs> Look at the calories, but don't faint when they see these calories. Because you know this cheesecake. Them calories were... You gotta eat that in moderation. <laughs> All right, to watch the way, but that's classic cheesecake. Okay, now everything that they have, they literally show you when you go to their website. You can go to their website. Now, here's the cool thing about this company most people are going to be saying, well, you can use food stamps, SNAP, you know, 
any place, most of these places. Well, when you're ordering from this company and you're using SNAP or food stamps, now you can use credit cards, debit cards, gift cards, okay? Uh, when you're ordering from them, okay, and you're using SNAP, because I have SNAP, uh, it doesn't cost, like if some places, Amazon, Aldi's, um, Instacart, like that, some of those places do take EBTs, but you have to have a credit card because you have to pay for the surcharge, the, you have to pay for the delivery charge, and also you have to pay for a tip, okay? With this company, when you're using SNAP or food stamps, uh, you only need a gift card, debit card, or credit card, you know, to check out, okay? And it just holds it. It, it doesn't charge it anything. That's just the way that system's made up. And then you'll click in person, and the person will deliver it to you, okay? And... It takes it all off of your uh, SNAP or food stamp card, okay? And it doesn't touch your money side of your SNAP or food stamp card. It just takes it all off of your SNAP or food stamp card if you're using SNAP or food stamps. And that's it. You don't have to pay no cash or nothing. It, all that's paid through your SNAP food stamps EBT, okay, card, all right? And I got this right here for a hundred bucks. Now, you, you know, you don't have to spend a hundred bucks. You can spend a small amount. They have everything, even ice cream. The cool thing about this is because my car is down and I'm not trying to lug a lot of stuff on the bus or all this other stuff. They deliver it to me, okay? And it's really, you know, they're not charging me a delivery fee. Uh, I don't need a credit card to pay for delivery fee, tip, and all that other stuff. No, I don't have to do that. If they just take it out of that eat that uh, SNAP card, and I'm done. Okay, I'm done. And if you're a new person, it don't take them very long to set you up. They will set you up real quick. Boom. The, the male and female delivery drivers are very professional, um, very, very cool, all right? Um, they don't come into your apartment or anything like that. Now, where I live, we do have some people who are handicapped or rather handicapable, however you want to say it, and they ask the driver, delivery driver, to bring it into their apartment and he does. He's nice. He's like that. And now think about this. Most times if I was going to shop, uh, I would have to go to at least two stores. It would cost me no less than $12 of gas. Okay. Then I have to sit in this long line. All right. And put the wear and tear on my car and my car is down right now. So, you know, but even though, even if I got it from like Instacart, okay. And I use my EBT or SNAP food stamp card. Uh, I still would have to have a credit card to pay for all the excess stuff, such as the delivery fee, uh, a t tip, you know what I'm saying? All that surcharge, all that I would have to have a credit card as well as my EBT or SNAP or food stamp card. Okay. This way, I don't. Okay. I just need that uh, snap card. It's done. No credit card needed. The only only reason I need a credit card, debit card, or even a gift card is when I set up my account because that's the way their program set up. They never charge it or nothing like that. I'll put that in there. Boom, it's set. They never charge it. All comes out of my snap card. Okay? And... That's awesome. And it pays for the whole thing. All right. Now, you will pick a delivery date and a time. Once you do that, you can call their phone number. Okay. And like the next day, you can call their phone number. If 
and see if they can deliver it earlier. A lot of times they'll set a delivery date, but you call them, they can literally, like I got mine a week earlier, okay, than my delivery date. So that's awesome. Also, holidays, those extra things you need on inspected gas is an awesome thing to get extra stuff delivered, especially if you know they're coming over. Uh, they're telling you, well, we'll be there in three days. We want to surprise you. Boom. You know? So it works. I love it. They're very professional, respectful of your environment. Okay? And one flat EBT. Okay? And they have stuff for everybody. They have dishes that's nothing but vegetables. So if you're a vegetarian, they got some dishes there for you. If you like to eat light, they got this. You saw the fish. Okay. You side the vegetables with that. They got something for you. Excuse me. All right. So I just wanted to show y'all that. And I mean, yep, this is going to last me a long time. Because like I said, I only eat once, twice a day at the most in the spring and summer. I always have. That's just, I don't eat that much in spring and summer. Okay. It's the winter and fall I got to worry about. Anyway. Thank you all for checking this out. I ask you to give this video and any of my videos that you enjoy a thumbs up. I ask you to subscribe if you like to. Because I got many more videos coming. All right. And without a doubt, I ask for your comments. Have you tried them? What do you think? Okay. And like I said, it works great if you have Snap food stamp card, but you don't have to. You can use a credit card. Now, they also, last but not least, they also can have it shipped to you through UPS, but you have to have a credit card for that. Yes, sir. That's right. They can have it shipped for you through UPS where they just, no, none contact, they just deliver the package, notify you when that package is delivered to, through UPS, and you go, on, go out there and pick it up and get it. None contact. I mean, they have so many. They've been around for a while, so they have lots of ways to serve you. Okay? And I guess I'll wrap to y'all later. But again, in the comments box below, let me know different places you've tried. And let me know if those places have surcharges or not. You know, whether Amazon, Instacart, you know, all these. Right? Or even you've tried them. All right. And I should wrap y'all later. Peace.